Welcome to Godspeed, and this car will stand the test of time. Today I'm going to review a 1998 Toyota Camry LE, aka Luxury Edition. Now for this fourth generation Camry, uh, it started in 1997 and ending its fourth generation in 2001. This color you do see here is called Super White, and it's one out of ten color options to choose from. Here we go. All right, now for the engine option, you get a 2.2 four-cylinder engine producing 133 horsepower, along with 147 pound-feet of torque. And uh, for the gas mileage, for the city, you get 23 uh, miles per gallon. And for the highway, you get 30 miles per gallon if you're driving it like you have some sense. <laughs> All right, let's look at the trunk space. Now for the trunk space, you get 14.1 cubic feet of uh, space in the storage compartment. As you can see, uh, these seats do fold down if you need some extra uh, storage or length, whatever you put in your trunk. All right, we're going to take a hop in the back seat. Boom shakalaka. All right, so you do get your little storage um, cubby holders in your seats. Uh, you get a little nice little, you get a nice little armrest right here. And also, this car comes with four cup holders in total. Two in the front, and two in the back. Um, now I'm 5'8", I do have a lot of room, as you can see, I do have a lot of room. Um, I would say if you're, if you're 5'10", or taller, it will be a, um, a little struggle in his back seat, and maybe the front, but uh, if you're 5'10", and shorter, it should be good back here. All right, let's take a look in the front. Now this car comes with a four-speed automatic transmission. Uh, you got your, you know, your typical glove box, storage as well. And you also get storage in each part of the um, doors in the front. Uh, you also get two power outlets, one up here and one down here. You got your air conditioner, of course, because uh, it is hot. It is real out here. It's not artificial. All right, uh, CD player. I then couldn't find a CD player, but I'm guessing uh, you could have installed a CD player and then have that option still. Tape, FM and AM radio. All right. You also get with the luxury edition, you get a sunroof. Here's the button, and here's the roof. And now, let's start this puppy up. All right. Boom. All right, we're gonna take it for a drive. Be right back. All right, and we're back. Now, it is a slow drive to, um, slow climb, I'm sorry, slow climb to 60 when uh, driving the car. Um, even with my pedal, my foot down to the, my pedal to the metal, my foot <laughs> down to the, um, the gas, the accelerator. Um, just now, I just found myself uh, with a lot of body roll, and it seemed like it tends to understeer uh, when turning corners. Um, but don't expect to win no drag races in this car. This is not why you buy a 1998 Toyota Camry. You buy this car for a peace of mind and a peace knowing that it will get you to A, B, C, and even Z every time you start it up. Um, now, looks wise, it won't, you know, it's not gonna turn no hair and break no necks. It's not, it, it won't give you the sleek, elegant design of a Ferrari uh, 558 Maranona, Mar Maranona, bleh, <laughs> or uh, 
the theatrical sounds of a McLaren B12, McLaren F1 that is, V12. But wheels didn't test the time. And whether it's a 1998 Toyota Camry or even a present day Toyota Camry, you can't go wrong. And I give it to them, they are, they are um, an icon in the reality mark car market. So, hey, thanks guys for watching, and Godspeed.